While Joe's finishing up, I'm going to go ahead and explain to you guys a scenario we have this morning. It's 5.30 here in East Georgia. We're about to make our way out to the deer woods. We had a nice cold front move in last night. It's probably 43, 44 degrees outside, which it's been high 50s, you know, getting in the 80s during the day. Today's high is only 71, so I might, we might have a late morning here in the stand. Hopefully not. Well, actually, no stand. Uh, hopefully we get there, get it done. Hopefully Big Nasty walks out. If he don't, I'm shooting old slick head and any goat. If she doesn't have a fawn with her. Um, but we're going to be sitting on the ground, just like the Indians. I will be solo filming. Hopefully I can pull it off. Um, I'm hunting with uh, my Browning BAR 280. Sorry, I heard the coffee get done. Ain't nothing like a fresh cup of Black Joe. Check out that cup. There it goes. Check out that cup. <laughs> uh, anyway, so that's the game plan. We're going to go do some deer hunting. Get it done. We got like two weeks till duck season. And then... Um, deer, deer hunt just gonna slack off for me. That's that's how it's been. That's how it is. <sighs> I have no idea why I deer hunt. This is like the. Seventh or eighth time I've went hunting. Haven't hunted the same spot more than twice. So the pressure's not here. Deer signs everywhere. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. If it wasn't for me, just loving being outside. And how much I desire deer meat. I probably wouldn't deer hunt. I'd probably just fish until duck season. But until then, I guess I'm just going to keep on trying. I have heard a bunch of squirrels, seen a bunch of squirrels, and heard a buku of crows. I'm about to pack everything up here. Might call my buddy up, see if he wants to go to the lake. I heard the crap here biting. Well, I'm back at the house, and while eating these delicious pork chops that Sam Ryan Lee made for me, I have decided and come to the conclusion that I'm gonna go back deer hunting this afternoon. Uh, main reason because duck season comes in in two weeks. I have no deer in the freezer whatsoever. Um, and I, I really I really need some deer meat. Really, really bad. So I'm about to take a nap. Wake up, it's 11.40. I'll get up, probably get something else to eat. And I'm gonna try to be back in the woods about four o'clock because I think it's getting dark now at seven so I will see y'all back in the woods well that nap was pretty amazing um I just want to check in with you guys as I get ready to head back out into the deer stand well head back out into the woods I'm gonna be sitting on the ground except this time I got a cameraman Will Shelton I'll introduce y'all in just a second but uh my 75 to 300 millimeter zoom lens came in so get a close up on some big nasty bucks hopefully or a big old fat nanny goat and also wide angle lens that way y'all don't have to I don't have to sit so far away from you guys and be a lot easier on doing these vlogs and stuff so I'm about to get all this put it in the bag get everything set up put my hunt clothes back on and we will see y'all in the woods I got my new wide angle lens on there. That thing is pretty sweet, but well, I'm gonna introduce you guys to my buddy Will Shelton with Down Deep Outdoors on YouTube. I'll have his link below. Y'all make sure to go check him out. Um, he's actually gonna be filming me this afternoon, so I don't have to do it solo. Give me a hand, and help me out. So y'all be sure to help him out. Go check him out. See y'all in the woods. <laughs>
got him. Got it done this afternoon, baby. I, I saw him in the camera right right as you shot. Like I said. Let's go take a look at this bad boy. It's kind of dark, but for the most part, you see. Here, hold on. Hey, I, I've got to turn it all the way up. Got it done this afternoon. Look at that, folks. Yeah, Mainframe eight. Ooh. Good right there, fellas. Oh yeah. Give this bad boy out for a pit. It's a nice pit. A nice deer there. Alright guys, well I uh, appreciate y'all joining me on this hunt, hope y'all enjoyed it, I'll see y'all next time.